let me ask you one honest question. Are you a procrastinator? Well, this guy is. And I will tell you what, I'm, sometimes I have the hardest time getting started with a project or something that I'm working on. So I got something you guys are gonna really like today. Check this out. In this small little box is a perfect addition to your desk and your setup that will allow you to sort of manage your time and make doing these tasks that you're procrastinating or putting off even better. This is what's known as a Pomodoro timer, or it's basically a digital timer cube. Now the folks from Tick Time sent this over for me to take a look at and give my honest feedback on. So let's open it up and try it out. What's up guys, this is Carl from Techful Goodies. And like I said, I mean, I procrastinate all the time. And I have actually put this back in the box because I used it for about a week and a half here and I'm absolutely in love with it. It has helped me become more productive every single day and really kind of keeps me focused on the things that I wanna work on, right? So a little bit of background on this tick timer here. This is by tick time and Pomodoro is basically a way to be able to kind of time out your different tasks during the day. I think they originally started out as a Kickstarter and have become extremely successful. So here it is. You can see that it's basically just a small little timer. Um, on the back here, it's got an LED indicator depending on if it's charging or if it's on. On the front here, you've got two buttons. One is a minute plus, a second plus, so you can create your own timers, um, and you can turn it on just by clicking both buttons. It charges by USB-C, and it is as simple as, see these all these numbers on the side? 30, 25, 15, 3, 5, and 10. You can basically use this when you're doing something. So let's say, for example, okay, I want to start filming a new video in, in 10 minutes. I need 10 minutes just to relax and then we'll get started. All you have to do is put it with the number you want up facing. As soon as it sets down, you can see that the 10 started blinking, okay? And if you look on the side here, you can see that it is now counting down from 10 minutes. Now I've picked it up. If you wanna pause it, you can actually put it up in this orientation so that the timer's actually paused. As soon as I put it back down to 30, it goes to timing for 30 minutes. If I put it back to 10, now it's back to a 10 minute timer. Small, compact, sits on your desk, and all you literally have to do is say, all right, I'm going to check my emails, get through my email box, give me 25 minutes to do that, and it'll go. Let's say I wanna do 10 minutes or five minutes of meditation, just relax, breathing in, out, I can do that. So one other thing you can do, which I think is super important, is that you can actually set your own time, right? So this is seconds up, so I can do a three second timer. And when I put it down, that was three seconds and the lights light up and show you exactly what's going on, letting you know that the alarm is done. And just another note on these buttons on the side, you do have a minute plus and a second plus. This is related specifically to setting your own timers. So if I set it at five seconds there, that's fine. I put it down and it's telling you that it's starting with five seconds, but it's not actually doing three minutes. It's doing my five seconds. Now these buttons on the side also have the ability to change the volume up and down. Or if you don't like that loud of a volume, you can change it all the way down or to silent and the lights will still blink. So that's super helpful. A couple of features to note about this little awesome timer here is that it does have a sort of dual mode. You can count up and count down. Uh, so if you want to time something, you're able to do that. Um, it does have the six preset set counters around the side. When you do charge it, this little indicator on the back will blink. And when it's blinking, it says the battery is lower than 100%, but when it's solid, you'll know it's fully charged. And again, about the only con that I really see with this device, if I'm being honest, is the fact that when you do start a timer, I'm a fidgety kind of guy. So uh, sometimes if you pick it up and mess with it, it might reset your timer. It might go to a different time. So what you want to do is basically like they used to say with the old uh, infomercials, set it and forget it. Start your task, get going, get something else on your desk like this little sweet Thor thunder hammer. Mess around with that or this little fidget device from Captain America. So... Um, I did a little unboxing on about five of those little fidget toys. I'll put the link up above if you want to watch that. It does have an adjustable alarm volume. It does have a customizable timer if you're cooking. Uh, this is something I've used while I'm cooking too. You know, if I have something that takes, you know, 15 minutes and I need to come back, 
Uh, I'll put it on 15 minutes and let it go. One thing I do like about that is that I, like I said, you can adjust the volume. So sometimes I'm sitting in the other room. It's nice to be able to hear that from a good distance away. And again, this is the Pomodoro Timer by Tick Time. It has adjustable volume, silent mode, eats easy to read, flip and switch mode, rechargeable timer, compact size. And I'll tell you what, this is now a permanent addition to my desk. Uh, I'm not gonna recommend anything to you that is bad quality or badly made. This is a well-made product. And like I said, I've been using it for the last week or so. Um, 25 minutes to do a chore in the house, 30 minutes. And that's one of the biggest problems when you're a procrastinator is that you look at a task and you think to yourself, oh, I don't wanna start that, it's gonna take forever. But guess what? If I said, okay, you know what? I'm going to clean my kitchen for 30 minutes. Okay, set that down, get started. As soon as it's timing, I'm ready to go. As soon as it's done, even if I'm not totally done cleaning my kitchen, I've accomplished something. So if you're interested, I will leave the link down below. Toss me a like on this video. I really appreciate everyone that's been sort of supporting the channel. I've been doing this for about four or five months and you know, we're starting to grow. I'm a tech guy trying to try out some of these awesome little tech gadgets, maybe some things that you know about, some things you've never heard about. I had seen the tick time, but I never tried it out yet. But now that it's in my hands, this is a sweet little device. So I appreciate the guys at tick time for sending it over. Let me try it out. But again, this is Carl from Techful Goodies and I'm out.